Hi everyone, I'm here with Sarah Sampaio, the fabulous Victoria's Secret angel, to talk about Victoria's Secret's new Velvet Matte Cream Lip Stain, which is, I'm wearing it right now. And I'm wearing it right yeah, now. Yeah, <laughs> I have Obsessed on, and it's so hydrating. It is really I nice. I love, yeah. I'm wearing Drama, I think it's this one. Yeah, I'm wearing Drama. So, I always love a color on my lips. And I lo always love a matte finish, but I don't really tend to use lip stains because they really, really dry your lips. Um, but this one, it's actually really creamy. I don't know if you feel it, but it's like you feel like you're you still have a, a matte finish. Yeah, it has like a hydrating feel too. Yeah, exactly. You you don't get like all sticky and dry and like all shaped. And so it's I I'm really obsessed. I like. I have them sent all of the collars to me. I'm sure we can send them to you too. <laughs> no, they're beautiful. I love them. Like the texture is really, it's great for a matte. And I love how you chose to match it to your outfit. You that whole like matchy, accident. matchy. <laughs> well, that's a big thing right now. I feel yeah. like matching your lip color to yeah. your outfit. So it was an accident. It was kind of an accident. Uh, I, I had to do a fitting this morning and we went with this dress and, and we were like looking at the colors and drama was exact uh, same color. So it's kind of like a, a nice, coincidence. <laughs> no, it looks great. And Valentine's Day is right around the corner. So mm. I feel like these are really kind of a fun way to like amp up your Valentine's Day beauty look. Yes. Um, how would you like, how would you kind of incorporate this into a Valentine's Day outfit? Okay. So if you're like me, I wear a lot of black and sometimes you want to step up a little bit and not just be like a boring black dress and, and wearing a collar really takes it to the next level. It kind of brights up and your whole look makes it mysterious, makes it kind of like sexy and it's just by putting a lipstick. So uh, I'm always, who knows me and follows me knows that I wear a lot of red lips. <laughs> so you think a red lip for Valentine's Day? Oh, definitely. Would you do yes. more like a black jean and like a leather jacket or LBD? Like what's your outfit going to go? Uh, for personally, um, I like to go with like some either leather pants or, or like black jeans, a nice top, uh, maybe like a blazer, and I always go for black. <laughs> and some heels, and I would definitely put a red lip. That's awesome. And like boots, the so heels, boots, what kind yeah, of? Yeah, heels, boots. I mean, it depends how cold. It gets really cold in New York, so maybe some closed boots yeah. <laughs> to protect awesome. your little feet. <laughs> Have you shared these with any of your friends yet? Have they? Yes, I actually uh, gave some of to my friends and because I was like, oh my god, you have to try this. And when I'm obsessed with something, I'm really annoying and I get everyone, I give it to everyone. I was like, <laughs> you have to try this. Trust me, trust me. So when I actually shot the campaign, we shot it before it came out, I started telling my friends, oh my god, Victoria's Secret is going to come out with this lip stains. You have to get them. They're really good. And, um, and I think... People are really loving it. And they're perfect for that, like, signature Victoria's Secret kissy face. Yes. <laughs> so I was hoping you can kind of take us through. Ooh, okay, I can try. Do a little, like, demonstration. The kissy of, face? Yeah. Maybe let's put a little bit more on. Well, you, I think you have a good amount on if you want to, like, just... Do you want to put more of you? Yeah. Do your kissy face first, and okay. then we'll see. Yeah. So... What is, like, the steps? And I'm going to try to... <laughs> You know, do my best, Victoria's Secret um, Angel. I have two things. Sometimes I don't really like a kissy face because it makes, like, I have, like, really uh, uh, out cheekbones already. So when I do a kissy face, like, all you can see is cheekbones. So sometimes I just have. tend to, like, <laughs> laugh and just, like... <laughs> It's like you're in the end of the kiss. Okay. It's like you sent the kiss and then you're just laughing. <laughs> so you don't purse your lips you, at all? Well... I personally don't really like myself with like a little like, mm, like looks a bit weird. So <laughs> if you were going to do, so yeah, you, you keep an open mouth and kind of laugh. You kind of like, like just laugh. Like you just send a kiss and then you just laugh like. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. It's a good tip. So it's a more maybe natural it's and more, you don't look yeah. as like forced. Exactly. So would that be like your go-to selfie pose? Um, I like to I like to to laugh in my in my selfies. I think like a good energy and positive uh, energy in a selfie goes a long way. How many selfies would be fine on your camera roll? Oof, too many. <laughs> if you had a guess, a lot. I don't even know, but I think I definitely have over a thousand for sure. Yeah, I'm not fair. proud of that. That's fair with all your shoots <laughs> and everything. Um, so what's like another victorious your kind of signature? move that you do when you're maybe like the walk should we try the walk we can try the walk okay let me put this down do you do you, have you ever no no like no, no it's all in the hips okay all hips, right yeah so again okay, let's go a little bit back okay 
Okay. It's pretty easy. It's like one foot instead of in, in front of the okay. other. Left in front of right. Okay. No. Always left first? No, I'm joking. Oh, okay. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Okay. And you just make sure I'm gonna watch it's you first. all about the hips. Okay. And like give a little like, yeah, you're good <laughs> at it. And then you like turn. And then you're like, yeah. And then you come back. <laughs> It's all about the hips. So it's like all in like the hips. Yeah. Do they tell, when you have rehearsals, do they say like more hips or um, more? They just kind of trust. No, I think when we are at rehearsal, they, we kept, we, we usually really nervous at rehearsal, so no one smiles. <laughs> and then Ed comes live and is like, come on, people, smile. You're, you're supposed to be happy to be here. So uh, usually the second rehearsal, we're all like happier. And, yeah. Because uh, you do get like so nervous and into your head that sometimes you do forget to smile. And it's not like you're unhappy, but you're just like, <sighs> okay, okay. <laughs> so, so it's not really like, I think all the girls already have a signature each, each girl has a signature walk, yeah. so like Issa, and also Issa has her big hair flip. Yeah, isn't that a signature? Does. What is your signature? So some of the hair flip. Um, what do you love to do at the end of the runway? I tend to to do a wink. A wink. A That's smile. a good one. I can't. I can't even wink. Embarrassed <laughs> to say I that. Something that I did on my first show, and then I did it on my second. I did it on my third, and now I feel like I'm, I can't wink again. And then I get there and I wink, <laughs> and I can't like control it. <laughs> is it kind of like what comes to you in the moment? It's just kind of like you think. Like it's one of those moments that you practice at home and then you get to the runway and you forget everything and you do complete the opposite that you trained. It's so you just, just kind of like wing it and it comes it's just over you. Like, yeah, it, it's like you're with your outfit, with your wings and the performance is going and you know, it's just a unique moment that you can't really prepare to it. So you just kind of like take it all in and enjoy it and I tend to wink. <laughs> is there a secret to the hair flip? Mm. You're not a big hair flipper. I'll I'll do hair flips and shoots, not in 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 the runway because if you don't really get it, uh, if you're not really good at it, or if you like even hesitate for a millisecond, your hair is gonna end up all in your face. So you kind of you're either a master of it, and Isabel is really a master in it, or you just like stay away from the hair flip. And then it's gonna like stick onto your lips. And yeah, exactly. And even though I feel like your hair won't really stick on these, this mat is like a nice dress. This one, yeah, this one won't stick. But usually at the show we have like gloss on, and forget it. My hair just like it's like all like stuck to my lips, and there's like a lot of. Like, I have really big lips, so it's like gloss on it. It just like goes everywhere. And then I get off the runway and my face is full of gloss. And <laughs> so I tend to stay away from the hair flip on the runway. Yeah, that's like your. <laughs> so also uh, for Valentine's Day, obviously it's a big lingerie um, kind of holiday. Do you have like just like, dr like a closet full of lingerie? I imagine your collection is like overflowing. I have a lot. Well, <laughs> now I kind of live like between my place and my boyfriend's place, so I can like separate for both. <laughs> so I have like one in my place and a lot of his at his place. Uh, but yeah, I do have a lot of lingerie. You must have like, <laughs> like lingerie and like your matte lip stains are just everywhere. Yeah, they're like just everywhere. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, yeah, thank you guys. Are we, oh, we have any questions? Uh, yeah, we have some reader questions. Uh, Sarah wants, or sorry, Catherine wants to know <laughs> from Sarah, uh, before a Victoria's Secret shoot, do you do anything special when it comes to your workout or beauty routine? Uh, well, workout, we kind of have to be ready all year long, so you shoot lingerie not just, you know, one day a year. Uh, we shoot lingerie so many days a month mm -hmm. that we kind of have to be ready all year long, so it's, it really is a lifestyle of healthy, uh, healthy heating and a lot of, um, like working out constantly mm -hmm. it's all about a routine so that doesn't really change before a photo shoot but in terms of beauty I, t I try to sleep as much as I can um, and that's something planes really <laughs> help me with it's like getting my my sleep on track and not uh, drink a lot of water and I tend to do like a moisturizing mask the day like the night before to make sure my skin isn't dry and like just looks that that looks fresh do you have any like in-flight beauty rituals? Do you wear like under eye masks or do you pack anything? No, um, lots of uh, moisturizer, mm -hmm. that's for sure, and uh, lip balm. Mm -hmm. I have like five different lip balms in my, in my purse <laughs> and I can never find any of them. <laughs> uh, Barbara wants to know, uh, do you remember your first shoot for Victoria's Secret and were you nervous? Oh my God, yes, I remember. I, it was, that was like 
home. I was 19, so that was almost like six years ago. In February, I think. So it was kind of like literally six years ago, and I was shooting like their cotton cotton collection mm -hmm. and like like baby dolls and stuff like that. And I was extremely nervous because this has been was my first job in New York ever. And I remember it was something that I wanted so bad. I, I came to my agency in New York. I was like, I really would like to do Victoria's Secret, but thinking like if it happens, it's gonna happen in like years and, and then my first shoot like I got Victoria's Secret so it, it, I was really nervous and I it was an incredible experience but I got out I, I got out of there thinking like oh my god I don't know if I did a good job I feel like I messed up I don't know if I was like the right and then uh, I guess it went well. <laughs> Sharon wants to know how do you get your hair so shiny? <laughs> Ooh, so I gotta say a lot of it's genetics. I have to thank my mom and dad for that. Um, it really is so shiny. Thank you. <laughs> In person. But I do, I do like just use shampoo, uh, lots of conditioner, and I, I tend to do a hair mask uh, like maybe once or twice a week. Um, but besides that, it's just like drink a lot of water and eating healthy and I think it's most of it. I eat a lot of red meat. They say it actually helps with hair. I don't know if that's true, but... <laughs> uh, Beatrice wants to know who's your veteran Victoria's Secret model inspiration? Uh, I have so many, like all of the girls, like Giselle, I mean she's a force to reckon yeah, with. She's incredible. Yeah. Like, she's an icon. She's like everything every model wants to be. And then Adriana, all all her, the way that like 20 years later she still enjoys doing this as much as any mm -hmm. of us. Like it, it's, it's incredible. She seems her. like she's a cheerleader for you guys. Oh my God. Like, I love seeing all the photos of you, everyone together, and she's yeah. really just encouraging everyone. She's pretty, she's pretty incredible. She's a huge inspiration for me and for all of us. And the way she still enjoys doing this job 20 years later, it's, it's pretty incredible. Mm -hmm. But yeah. Uh, I think this is a good one to end on, actually. Alex wants to know, what do you do on days when you need a boost of energy or confidence? That's mm, great. That's a good one. You know, as anyone, I, always, always have, I also have bad days, and I feel like when those days, being with the people I love, or sometimes just get a hug from your best friend or your boyfriend or even your dog, <laughs> really get, makes you get out of that... Uh, zone or put some good music with like some Beyonce on Rihanna on mm. and you know get on your underwear and dance <laughs> like sometimes awesome. just like really just forget about what's happening that puts you yourself into that and just you know there's so many important things in the world and you just gotta enjoy life and you know sometimes you just gotta get out of that little world that you get yourself into sometimes. You, know, you get so worked up. You get so worked up that you just stressed. gotta like, you know what, breathe in, breathe out, go have a bath. Hug your dog. <laughs> Hug your dog or your boyfriend or your best friend. Uh, eat some pizza, put on some nice lingerie, put on a red lip, and you know what, life is beautiful and just enjoy it. It's it just, nice. yeah. It's great advice. Should we do a kissy face to say goodbye to everybody? Yes. A laughy kissy face with our lip yes. <laughs> All right, well thank you everyone for tuning in. Me and Sarah Sampaio, we're so Thank happy you to guys. have you all. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>